Hey guys, what's up? Rafe Raff here again with another video. Um, this is the video update to the 75 gallon um, that I'm building. Um, right now, you're looking at that 25 gallon nano. Um, all this, uh, everything from this tank is going to go to my uh, 75 gallon. So. Um, we got an algae scrubber working well. Um, not making any algae yet. Um, it's only been running for a week. Um, everything got a um, five gallon bucket there and a battery backup. It's moving to the 75 gallon, uh, 75 gallon aquarium. Uh, all my fish is doing well. Corals are growing. Um, everything in the tank is doing pretty well, pretty good. Um, but um, this is not. This tank is not what I'm uh, making this video for today. Um, so uh, just turn around, and that's my uh, end wall, 75 gallon. Um, it's already good with uh, filled up with RDI uh, water uh, mixed with salt salinity at 1.025 same as my uh, little nano um, I've put some rock in some rock rock in there uh, that's the live rock that came a couple of days ago uh, it's Fiji Tonga uh, live rock uh, there is a piece of uh, coral skeleton in there. Um, it's cool. I don't, I don't know if this is going to be my like uh, aquascape. Um, I originally wanted to do um, two islands, one here and one in the corner there. Um, but we'll see. Because um, what I want to do is I want to just take the nano just like it is and just put transfer it and put it in there and leave everything the, the same. Um, let me show you guys a little bit on, in the back. Um, it's still not finished. It's like kind of like cycling right now, but you know. Um, yeah, switch the sole to uh, to Coral Pro uh, by Red Sea Coral Pro. Um, so yeah, guys, don't mind the mess here, but, um, here now we have another five gallon here, that's my RDI unit here, but, uh, why I brought you back here is to show you guys this little critter that I found in my rock. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's good, or bad, or what, or... What kind of worm is it? If it is even a worm, but I don't know what it is. Um, kind of, I'm glad that it died and it came out while my rock is curing. Um, the rock was curing in this bucket over here. This is old live rock being cured here. Um, just wanted to let you tell you guys that no matter where you get your live rock. Even if you get it like the next day or you get it from somebody's tank and you put it right in your tank, you want to cure it first, you know. You want to cure it for like two weeks, you know. Um, you got to be patient, you know. All them, like, if you, even if you get like from somebody, like, let's say you got it today from somebody's tank, you know what I mean. The sponges that were on the rocks, as soon as they, you know, they, they come in contact with air, they die. So you know there's going to be die off on the rocks and you don't want that die off in your actual tank you know what i mean so you want to cure it first uh, put a uh, gfci um uh, unit right there um these are my led lights um i'll make another video showing them um these are so now i have uh, the blues are like very on the lower setting right now if I raise the blues up it's like really blue so I keep the blues in the low low 
Um, so if I want to just like shut this down and leave the blues, I can do that. Um, even like bomb them up a little bit. Um, or if I want to just leave like the daylight things on, I can do that and I can warm up real. So anyway, um, they're still not stable yet because I have to like um, stabilize them and hook them like right there. So that, um, so that, but yeah, that's my LED guy. And my, uh, those are my LED guys. Um, just the, oh, the top of the aquarium here. Um, there's a uh, Jibal WP40 and a W25 on the other side. Um, this is the overflow here where I haven't paint, painted it so I can see what the hell is going on in my overflow. Um, the sump down there, I have the skimmer running. You can't really see anything, um, but I have the skimmer running. Shit. I'm going to show you guys this. I'll make another video where we're gonna have some light, but anyway, uh, I want to show you this uh, DC Palm Jibal 1200. Uh, very, very good, uh, variable uh, speed pump. Um, it's great. The control, the controller is right here. I have it at half speed right now. And it's plenty of flow. Um, this is the. Uh, WP40 uh, controller. Everything is up and running. Um, I just have to like you know get everything from my uh, from my uh, 25 gallon here to uh, to my 75 gallon. So show you the sump a little bit here. With this uh, algae, um, like I said, there's not much going on right now. Um, it's only been running for a week, so got a week coming more. Um, the larva is growing. There's some more larva in there growing. That's miracle mud. Just a uh, tray of American mud in there. Oh well, no skimmer in this system at all. Um, so I got miracle mud and mineral mud in this system, and so it's uh, doing very well. Everything is it's growing. Alright guys, well I'll make another video in a little bit when I, uh, when I get that 75 going, alright? Peace. Change my aquascape in a little bit to make room for my 25 gallon, uh, the rocks and everything to go on that left, on that um, right corner over there. Um, and I just kind of like, I don't know, I wanted to make two islands, so one over there, one over there, kind of like stacked everything up to, you know on top of each other uh, got a couple nice caves in there um, I used um, the putty uh, not putty oh, the anyway the coralline uh, thing the coralline looking putty thing um, they cement them together uh, so far so good um, like a little cave there uh, like a little bridge type of thing and that they get a little cave um, a fake um, not fake the coral skeleton um, it's a coral skeleton I don't know what kind of coral it is but um, and so is this one 
Um, that's, they're cool things, you know. Um, unless they have, uh, really, you know. Hey, what's up, guys? Reef Raff here again. Um, just showing you my 75 gallon, um, in wall reef tank. Um, it's been up and running for three weeks now. Um, everything is doing well. Uh, I'll be transferring my 25 gallon on that side over there. Here's the first resident of the tank. The zebra, whatever. Um, crab. Or, uh, hermit crab. So, things doing well. Well, the LED is half and half. Tanks have blue, have, um, you know, but, uh, just playing around, you know, other thing looks good, um, I just gotta fix the sand up a little bit, alright, just wanna make a video of the army crab, first one in the tank, peace. Here we're at Camden Aquarium, Camden, New Jersey, um, a bunch of gun for us. Paulson's Zinnias, Salantas, Oak School Corals, all kinds of corals. This is a fish on the tank. Um, long thing, uh, banner fish, blue paper angel fish, harlequin fish, lunar rat, rat bird rat. Is um, a whole bunch of bunch of bunch of fish, pickle tanks. Bubble coral, mandarin, just the black hippo. Mandarin drag, rangar cardinal, six line wrasse. Uh, Bubble tip anemone, carpet anemone, orcula clownfish, skunk clownfish, and uh, ritter, 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 Powder blue tank, trigger fish, and yellow tank. Some fake corals in there.
butterfly fish, starfish, long nose hope fish. Seahorse and the alligator pipefish. 